to create water tank logic we click on TIA portal version 17 now click on create new project here you give the name water tank logic click on create button now click on project view click on add new device now click on controller from this arrow select S7-1500 click on CPU to extend here you find 1515F to expand here you select this third one click on OK button now uncheck this box click on next uncheck again click on next button click on this down arrow select full axis next and finish double click on ethernet port now click on add new subnet click on network view here you see pn slash ie underscore one one ethernet cable link is up here now click on add new device click on hmi here you click on smatic comfort panel select this 7 inch display click on this 700 comfort click on 700 comfort select 6av2 now click ok select this text welcome and delete also remove this rule screen and delete now scroll up on this project tree click on program block expand this select main ob1 now we create uh, now we create tank ladder logic select this horizontal line and first click on no contact double click here we write m1.0 rename this tag here we write start push button click on change first click on horizontal line click on no contact give your memory bit 1.1 rename this tag we give the name stop push button click on change now click on horizontal line select this output contact click here we give the m100.0 memory bit click this horizontal line click on right arrow now select these arrow we will click on open contact select this arrow upward contact when the start button is pressed the M100 is 
comes on and when the operator releases this start push button this memory 100 contact will be latched with this contact we give your name cycle on memory bit click on change copy this and paste here for latching this memory bit 100 Now on network 2, select this, double click on no, normal, double click normally open contact, copy this M100 and paste here. Now click this horizontal line, select NO but contact, select NO contact, select this line, click this right arrow, click on arrow, click on NO contact, select again this arrow, up arrow, and here for the output. Here we give the NO contact and after that we give you the first pump output. Click here, we give you a, we give you a Q0.0. First here give M1.3 Here we retag as low level sensor Click on change. And here we give high level sensor. So this M1.4. Here we give the name pump one. Click on change, copy and paste here. Now we see that the when the operator press this push button on M1.0 memory contact comes to on and this will mix on to M100 cycle on memory bit and this will latch with the help of M100.0 normally open contact. Same here on network 2 when this M100 bit is comes on this in network bit here also comes on and due to the low level sensor this contact from NO to NC contact becomes on this NC contact becomes on and high level sensor which is already in NC contact so this will mix the pump one on pump one latch with the help of pump one contact now here we create same type of network network three for that purpose we copy 
and paste over this network 3. And we delete this. Now we copy this high level contact here and place here in this net. and remove this and cut this contact and place over here. And delete this contact and copy this contact and delete this pump one contact for pump two here we give the name q0.1 q0.1 and copy this contact now here we put the bit q0.1 output now we replace with this nc contact when the operator press start push button this and no contact becomes NC contact and high level sensor if the level of the water is high this NO contact becomes NC contact and supply pass from this pa supply pass from first contact to second contact where is the low level sensor is already on so the pump 2 also comes to the on and will be remain less with this Q0.1 pump 2 contact. Now for the uh, now now we insert one new network and here we use the contact and no and copy here pump one contact and place over here and click over this math function and bring this adder circuit over here drop over this green dot now here we click here we gives md50 rename this use as a integer now we are you use here integer function and rename this tag count click on change button and here we put value 1 here we copy this md we copy this con and place over as you see the one pump one comes on this value for adder is increased by adding 1 and it will goes to the output this becomes 1 also and again as long this pump 1 is on this is adding 1 value and increase in its output so from 1 to 2 and 2 to 3 like it this circle is continue running and for the pump 2 we use here another contact click on this arrow 